I'm here at the Package and Innovation Show at the NEC in Birmingham, and I'm with Simon Smith, Managing Director of CS Labels. Simon, please tell me, what are CS Labels doing here today? Uh, with CS Labels, we did this show last year, but what we're doing this year is very much we're launching our uh, acquisition in terms of new digital press, the digital cheetah press, and what we wanted to do is at the same, t- at the same time take the opportunity to launch a number of new products to the marketplace. The acquisition of the new press is, is going to be enabling us to transfer some production over from our existing presses, transferring it over to a faster digital press, but by keeping the uh, existing presses, we can use those for R&D and bring some new products to the marketplace. Fantastic. So tell me more about the Cheetah Press. The Cheetah Press is the latest uh, press that Zycon have announced. It was launched at Label Expo in Chicago. It is 56% faster than the existing Zycon presses that we operate. Uh, It also incorporates a slightly different toner as part of the ICE family. Um, Basically, the compounds within the toner are slightly different, which means that it can be fused at a lower temperature. So also, they are cheaper, 10% cheaper, so it enables us to... Uh, do longer runs and be more competitive in the flexo market. Uh, so that's why one of the reasons why we purchased the press. And in terms of being innovative, this product is quite unique. Please tell me more about the innovative ways that this product works. Well, uh, the, the, the big thing about it is that because it's so much more faster, you can start to open up other markets which previously perhaps weren't available to you. So, for instance, uh, we're looking at doing digital heat transfers. So by printing what is effectively a no-label look and printing a transfer and transferring that onto a product, we can obviously talk to our customers about other ways in which you can sell digital technology. And the heat transfer is non-peelable, isn't it? That's right. I mean, basically, you are transferring it direct onto your product, whether it be a glass bottle, whether it be an aluminium container, it can be wood, it can be anything you want it. And obviously, the, you can then start to take advantage of the t- digital technology in that you can personalise a whiskey bottle, you can put serial numbers onto a whiskey bottle, you can obviously put regional products onto the bottle. So it's a much more cost-effective way of actually enhancing your brand and getting that into the marketplace and say conventional printing. And what's next for CS Labels in 2015? Well, we're also bringing to the marketplace digital pouches. Uh, we recognise for some time that obviously there was a big opportunity in the flexible packaging market, but there were a number of limitations with the technology. Now, we've been able to overcome a lot of those technology uh, problems with working with a number of partners to be able to bring to the marketplace a digital pouch where we are not limited by run lengths. At the end of the day, you can obviously print variable data, you can personalise them, you can obviously print them across a number of SKUs. So it's a very exciting product that we feel that we can bring to the marketplace. And it's probably where Labels was five years ago when digital first started to attack the Flexo market. There aren't many players in the marketplace, so it is, it's really is what we feel that we've got to fill to ourselves the next two or three years to take advantage of. Good stuff. Simon Smith, thank you very much. Thank you.